you're going to stick around. We did twist Salita's arm to stick around for the cocktails. That was so hard to do. Yep, oh, yeah. she wants her cocktail on Friday night. <laughs> yeah, okay. and of course, these are not the cocktails of 20-year-olds. These are grown-up cocktails. Are grown Absolutely, up cocktails. yes. And so More Magazine has come up with a variety of libations sure to please an older palate. And here to take us through these grown-up drinks is Julie Reiner, owner and beverage director at the Clover Club in Brooklyn. Hey, yes. how are you? Welcome. We're very nice excited about this, I have to tell I'm you. I'm excited, too, because it's Friday and everybody needs a cocktail. Absolutely. So, this is the classic? This is, yeah, I'm going to walk you guys through a few trends that are happening these days. Classic cocktails are very hot. Um, a lot of great classic cocktail bars that have opened up in the city. Mm -hmm. This first cocktail is our house cocktail at the Clover Club. It is made with gin. We'll start with that. Mm -hmm. Two gin ounces can be of gin. very smooth, surprisingly. It's it done can. properly. Exactly. It's really all about how you mix it. Um, so these are two drinks I always say are the gin drinks for gin haters. Somebody tells me they don't like gin, this is what I give them. That's oh, really? Fine. Okay, yeah. so now what are you putting in So right this there? is raspberry syrup. Okay, mm. that's what makes it so pretty. Yes. Uh, dry vermouth. Well, that also makes it pretty. Oh. A little bit of egg white, now that which the froth, egg white. Right? Yes, oh. egg white. And that's okay. That's <laughs> yeah. this is okay. Is this the is this is something that was used in a lot of classic cocktails. It actually gives the cocktail texture. Um, and then lastly, a little bit of lemon juice. Okay, and I understand that you are the world's greatest shaker. So let me see how you do that. <laughs> yeah, shake oh, right. Come on, I'll Maria shake this was one, but practicing then Maria's earlier. Maria's gonna shake. So. She's gonna shake the next the next one. Okay. All well, right. So shake no, it away. All right. And this. talk about as you're shaking. Tell me what is the secret. That's right, Julie. The secret of a great cocktail is balance. So you want to make sure you have the right amount of sweet, the right amount of spirits, the I right amount never, of tart. I've never seen anybody let you guys shake see? like that. Okay, you're gonna you shake are like you mean it. I, 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 I don't know about this. the egg white on this one. No, no, it's oh, so I trust good. me, it's, it's safe. So good. I wouldn't give it to you if it Let's wasn't. Let's move on, Julie. Okay. So the next cocktail is called the Southside Fizz, and this is something that is very popular in my bar. We are making this with a little bit of mint, sugar, lime juice, Whoa. and Hendrix gin in this one. Hendrix gin has a little bit of cucumber and rose petal essence mm. to so it. This is kind of a um, So I've shaken this one up. This one is not, well, it has mint in it. It's more like a mint uh, gin mojito than. Mint Ooh. gin mojito. Yeah, How's exactly. that? Exactly. Mm, it's it's, it's delicious. delicious. This is, again, one of those drinks that everybody loves when I when I give that to them. Mm. Now, oh, wow. moving Cheers. along to mm. another trend <laughs> that we're seeing. This is delicious. Um, this is modern weird. tropical cocktails. Okay. So you don't have to be in the tropics. It's tropical. sort of the reinvention of a lot of tiki cocktails were just over juiced, over sweet, over so sugared. I grew up in Honolulu, Hawaii. So this is something that I really love. This cocktail has aged rum, mm -hmm. uh, an allspice syrup that we make, okay. fresh squeezed pineapple juice, a little bit of fresh lime juice, and then we top that off with champagne, mm. just to give it a little bit of a lift. That's fabulous. Everything's better with I'll champagne. I'll get you some it wonderful is. drinks Absolutely. from the Cayman Islands. I know that. people say everything's better with bacon, but I say everything's better with champagne. <laughs> you're gonna, I think you're both gonna of them here fit the bill. The back. I know, I'm mixing up my Louboutins. I'm gonna move over here All right. so that you can work on the next so, drink, and I know you have to mm. give Maria an opportunity yes. to shake something she's up. Gonna, oh. She's gonna get her opportunity right here. <laughs> so this last thing is right. savory cocktails. Now, you know, favorite. we do brunch at the Clover Club on the weekends, and I wanted to create a cocktail that was a little bit, you know, similar to a Bloody Mary, but not a Bloody Mary. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So what this is, is a muddled uh, cherry tomatoes with basil that I've put in these glasses and I've already muddled. How do you muddle? This is a muddler, and basically what you do is you just mash whatever it is that you're okay. doing this lightly. That's a great way to impress your guests. Yep. Yes, it is. <laughs> really. With your muddler. Nice. And Where do you find a muddler. <laughs> uh, you know, you can buy them at restaurant supply stores. Uh, a lot of like high-end kitchen stores will mm -hmm. sell them. Mm -hmm. um, cocktails are hot, so you know you find them. You'll find them just about anywhere that I sells that sells uh, barware anywhere. So, Lita, do you have a muddler? I, I have a mortar. You could use and, that, right? Yeah, sort of. You, can use that. you know what? You can use whatever is going to match whatever it up for you. <laughs> you should probably make <laughs> no. the standard operating guest thing here that right. we get muddlers. So we get our magic okay, Maria, seal going. Go. So you're safe. Thank you, girl. And I'll, I'll use this one. <laughs> the tandem so shake. Fun. It's, 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 it's actually like that. You want to try it? It's actually like that um, the thing that works your arms. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Exactly. It's very good for your, for your, for your arms. Technique. 
Julie, thank you so very much. We've My got to pleasure. Try that. Pleasure. I want to see how it looks. You, you obviously did so straining it. Yeah, that just to make sure that amazing as it comes out. I don't I have any particles it to, in there to not be that. I'll help you with that. <laughs> All right, let me let you taste that. Cheers, ladies. Happy Friday. Happy Thank Friday. Thank you. Happy this one, Friday. Please. All right, I will take that. Oh, Look at her little nice. garnish. You got to hit it right great. on the soft spot. Thank you so <laughs> Thank very you much. So we welcome. really appreciate You're it, welcome. Julie. We love it. And you know what? We loved her character in The Office, and now she's starring opposite Matt Damon in The Green Zone. I got a chance to have a little coffee and catch up with actress.